open the file of a software and a driver. You can see that there will be a variant of reprint with an e-software in it. Double click to open. Double click to open. Next, next. You can see that there is already a reprint icon on the desktop. It proves that the reprint software has been installed. Open TX bar by curve. Right click on this folder to copy. Open file location. Double click to open. Double click to open. Right click paste. Click. OK now this folder has been replaced. The curve has now been put into reprint software. Now to open the reprint software to set. Right click to open. I can see the demo version shown here. We need to plug the dongle into computer. OK, after putting the dongle on the body, UVS will be shown here. No need to set up printer. First, printer management. Set the TX Baba as the default printer. It is not the default printer. And then, set spot colors. Spot color. Spot color. Spot color channel 1 is minus 0 1. Spot color channel 2 is 0 1. Then spot color 1 set to small dot mode. Spot color to set smooth mode. Click OK. OK, all reprint software had been set up. After import the pattern, press CTRL to select the layer of image. Click on new spot color channel. One hundred, okay. Then select it again and create a new spot color channel. OK. By default the first spot color channel is white. The second channel is varnish. If you only need white and color, that means you only need to. Set one spot color channel. If you set up the picture of spot channel, you can start it anywhere you want. Save it on the desktop first. The format must be TIFF format. Click OK. Import pattern into reprint software. Click OK. Here will show your image size. You can is and the size on PS. It is also possible to change the size on reparent. Both is okay. After adjusted the size, click to print. 
Here you can choose 16 paths or 12 paths. Choose according to your needs. After selecting, click print. You can choose any storage location and now choose save it to desktop. Take a name down by Azure or other one. Click to print. There will be a progress bar here. After the progress bar is complete, a PRF format file will appear on your desktop. You can see there is a PRF format image on the desktop. The next step is to use this PRF format image to print on reprint software. This lesson also ends here. Thanks for watching. Bye.